Erev Tov Kharim. My name is Stephen Ben Danun, and you are watching Israeli News Live. We are getting all kinds of reports out of Israel and also the United States. It seems that Israel has closed down an immediate uh, cessation of all embassies worldwide as well as consulate offices all worldwide. Uh, this is being blamed on the strike that's going on over in Israel. Uh, in the interior ministry, but there's a lot of speculations that Israel may be preparing for war as well. Uh, we've also heard that the United States is closing embassies in the Middle East, so one can only speculate why embassies would be closed in such a time as this. Uh, could it be? And we know that again today, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has been again, once again, saying that they will defend themselves against anyone that is trying to wipe them off the face of the map. Tensions are definitely high, and we're about to head home and very soon. So we're, we really reach out to you as well and ask you, pray for Israel. If you've ever prayed for Israel, this is a time to pray for her. If you've ever prayed for us, we ask that you will sincerely pray for us. We know where we're headed, and we know that we will soon be back in Israel. And this is the only time that I can see uh, and hopefully in the future as well, there will still be more time that we can help uh, the, the Jewish people in different ways. But that time is running out. We have to keep in mind, even in the story of Joseph, the time, the seven years of plenty finally came to an end. And then came the seven years of tribulation. We're at the door of that hour. So we ask you to pray for us. Keep us in your hearts. Keep our family lifted up. My wife, Yana, myself, my father-in-law, Stefan, our children, Ariel and Ethan, because we're going into a place to where only God himself can keep our family safe. We thank you for all that you've been doing in helping and supporting this ministry, and we ask that you would continue to be a part of that, for that's what makes this possible. Uh, our news feeds will be a little bit difficult here for the next couple of days, uh, but we will try to keep you updated as much as we possibly can as we begin to make our travels. God bless you, and good night. I'm Stephen Bendenun, and you're watching Israeli News Live.